Hello, my name is Martin, Martin Lenz, and this is my best practice. My best practice is to teach how to ask questions. A typical teaching situation is you're standing in front of a class, you ask, are there any questions, and you're met with total silence. And I wondered how can I break that embarrassment or turn it around into something positive. And I thought I actually have to teach how to ask questions because it's never taught. And so I did. And devised a structure of how to analyze assumptions and tease out your own confusions really. And so I realized that the situation in the classroom changed. As a philosophy student, I think it's really important to engage critically with the material. Rather than a lecturer that just feeds you questions and then you automatically have to answer, I think I found it very important that instead I could develop my own questions and I could also learn to be more critical about all the different elements of the questions and evaluate uh, my own questions and that really helped me to independently engage with what I study and be able to create my own opinion about things. I think asking questions is essential in academic as well as other professional contexts, so it carries over easily. And I think the most important aspect of it is to figure out how the question, how the confusion arises. Why is it there? Most often you find that it is expectations of the text saying one thing that it isn't, of these expectations being frustrated and if you unpack your own expectations, you begin to grapple with what is at hand. And that you can do in various contexts. 